said it's not 7 a.m. Looks like the sun is going down. You might have guessed right. It's that time of the year. Nighttime frost. Get in and get out. I could just imagine what the lease is like. We are going to be going to... Luckily not the 8 to 10, as far as I know. Uh, we got some stuff we got to grab. Uh, from the Bronson. And we're going down to the Sylvester, which is off the Rapid. And we got to grab stuff from that uh, kilometer 10 water pond. And take it down to a lease that's on Sylvester. Supposedly we're just moving the test stuff and it sounds like the work tanks. Which I think is only six tanks. And we got to grab a bunch of other insulated tanks as well. So I think I'm on tank duty, just being tractor all night. Not super, super pumped about the ordeal, but it's coming and it comes every year, twice a year, spring and fall. So we're just going in, we're going to fire up, we're going to leave the shop here in like half an hour. Not a big rush. She said, be out of the Bronson. By uh, we'll leave at eight, Bronson. You can't get on there till ten. It's only an hour and a half, so relatively, I got an hour before I gotta leave. But we'll probably leave in the next thirty minutes or so. Peeps are all getting ready <coughs> to get going here. Almost got stuck. Soft there. I gotta go in and get my key. Key to life. This still isn't fixed. Hi, can I get a large two cream one sugar? I like how the sign says see you tomorrow. I'm just anticipating that I'm gonna be there because I'm Jones and out. I'll be sleeping. So as I approached town, I started to see the ominous glow. That means that uh, snow. And I thought I seen flurries and uh, yeah. It's been confirmed there's some flurries in the air. Coffee before I hit the bush. Okay, can you see that in that, that light? I don't know if this camera is that good. I gotta retorque two tires on the trailer here quick back two axles got four new tires or well two new insides because they're wearing real hard on the inside to keep an eye on that i might need a wheel alignment which this trailer's not that old it was practically almost new when i got here
good three, two to three centimeters, so nothing at all, but it certainly looks like we're gonna get more than that. <laughs> big fan of working in the dark anymore maybe <sighs> shadows there's a little bit of light here so it's not too bad but my first rounder I was completely crooked and then I pulled the tag it was on ice it just went sideways right up to the roll I was like oh, I'll just keep going 
suck the first tank up against the pans. And then, uh, yeah, then I was stuck on the pins. <laughs> Had to get Shane to come over and winch it sideways for me there. And then uh, we pulled the back tank sideways a little bit, and then we got her on. The joys of working in the dark on ice and mud. Doesn't matter how seasoned you are, it's gonna bite you in the ass sometimes.
3 o'clock. Just getting to the good stuff now.
good old corner. Yeah, we're down here on the 13 of 6 corner. Me, it's a 3 of 34. We're grabbing a couple loads from the 8 of 10. It's 4 a.m. What are you guys doing? Oh, some things I'd rather be doing. I'll sleep good when I get home. Or not home. MQ 2.8 on the 3 of 34. To the hotel. We've uh, swindled hotels because uh, hard to sleep in the truck in the middle of the day, you know? And I still have my bunk heater, so we'd be waiting for that. Did it fix that wiper gnome? Kind of in the ditch here a little bit too much. Can I come out? Brakes. <laughs> Old habits die hard. Oh yeah, walk her out of there. Loaded wide, coming up two point hill, two point eight hill on thirteen of six. The snow is like on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off, and it's like you need to just be off. Yeah, Shane went to put a tank on the edge of the leaves back there. It's methanol tank. It's like putting this out of the way. Buried. Three quarters of the way up his tires. It's like, don't go back there again because I'm leaving. But Taylor just showed up, so. Yeah, let's see that. It's a really sharp ditch. You definitely don't want to go in, huh? Like that. Fuck. How many times have I been around this corner? <laughs> well, don't back into the snow pile, it rips off mud flaps. Yeah, it's still coming up 2.8 hill. Is that stack on the far left with a white bank on it? Oh, yeah, either that one or the one right in front of me. Oh, there you go. Don't think I gained anything. I haven't put a chain on the back tank yet. I just wanted to get out of everybody's way. Oh, yeah. If you can four on the 3 to 34.
Orange City. Up against the snowbank. I'm like, ah. It's up the hump. You gotta get it just right. And obviously I was not getting it right.
want to go just straight ahead out of here or what? Just straight ahead, yeah, about 10 feet or so, you know. Welcome to night number two. It is 10 p.m. Sun came out enough this afternoon where it took off all the ice off the road, which is nice because coming in off the pavement, we're drifting some of those corners even though we were only doing like 50, trying to carry some speed to make the first couple of hills the kilometer two to chain up. So we're not all piled in at the entrance off the pavement. Little sketching spots there, yeah. Like I said, we got with three centimeters last night, just enough to pack everything and make everything kind of real slick. Highway was a sheet of ice, which. Does it matter which end where we start loading out here, uh, Rolly? Really? Slow ice on the highway. Yeah, it's all good. I think only two or maybe even six tanks total out of like, Roddy said he had like 33 tanks we had to get out of here. <sighs> so there's a, a tall, tall order tonight here to get a... Speed chase are loaded, I'll get you to back up and we'll get out of your...
to see what it doesn't look like. Barefoot this time. Fuck yes. Blood of wine, three on the three and thirty-four. It's nice and crisp, the stars are out, the moon is shining. It's chilled right off. I have no idea what the temperature is, because that's broke. Loaded wide, 2.8, 13 to 6. Someone should really put some extra dirt on the inside of that. Loaded onto the 3 at 34 at 7. been so bad if someone didn't come in here the other day and back up 40 times and make all these ruts I had to drive across and now they're frozen solid. That is rough. Half hour to tie all this stuff down. And we're done, we're going home!